On behalf of the whole WeShape Tech crew, we are so excited to see so many new faces here tonight. So as you might know, we are sold out since two weeks, which is absolutely amazing. But we had many requests from people who actually wanted to join tonight but couldn't. So please take your Twitter and your Instagram stories and share as many insights as possible. And don't forget to tag us at WeShape Tech and also use the hashtag. And for those of you who want to receive the video, because everything that is happening tonight is also recorded, um, subscribe to our newsletter and it will be sent out on Friday. And of course, then you will receive each and every month an inspiring stories about role models among us. So, what is WeShape Tech and who stands behind this organization? Currently, we have a chapter in Basel, Bern and Zurich and it's an amazing uh, thing to, to share with you because tonight we can openly talk about the fact that we just opened a new chapter in Geneva earlier this month. So big applause for that. <laughs> so what is Reshape Tech all about and what are our values and goals? So our organization is based on four pillars. The first one, is, I mean, to, sh to, to say it in a short and, and a concrete way, we are a network that is dedicated for greater diversity in technology and innovation. And we are very much keen to, to say that, that it's about we, because we believe in the we, because we believe that we can build bridges between genders, but also different backgrounds and different ages. And we think that if it's a we, everyone can benefit from a more diverse workplace. So we have a network of more than 1,300 women and men that we connect with each other at events like this and other opportunities. We often talk about role models, and this is also why we came here tonight, because it's still the fact that only on a global scale, only 10% of top management is female and only 8% of all the head of states are women. And at the same time, studies show that if you see female role models, especially as a girl, especially as a woman, this has a huge impact on what you think is possible and important for yourself. And in this whole discussion, we often also forget that it's not only important for women and girls, but it's also very much important for your brothers and your fathers and your co-workers. So this is why we host this female, uh, this big boss ladies tonight. And we put female role models on stage. The third pillar is about insights. We regularly host events like this, but we also host workshops where we get together and share our knowledge and learn from each other. We have an amazing community with many inspiring women who also take matters into their own hands. And this just happened a few weeks ago when Sarah, she's also in the audience, approached us and wanted to, to make an introduction and a crash course about machine learning and AI, which will happen on August 21. But there are many more events. And if you are also burning for a specific topic, then come and talk to me afterwards in Yapro. The fourth pillar is the empowerment. Because we can talk about diversity, but it's not just a numbers game. It's really about shaping attitudes and changing some, something in organizations from the top down and the bottom up. So this is also why we regularly partner with companies to create more opportunities and shape the attitudes and the social awareness there. And tonight we have the great pleasure that Swiss Re Institute is hosting us together with their startup IPTQ and I think we owe them a big big applause for hosting us and just making sure that every run, everything runs smoothly.